what's happening you already know waiting on my bus um Yeah, man, it's just no days off type of shit like that. That's the kind of life I'm living right now. For your safety, there you go. please stay on the SPX platform. Do not stand in bus lane. People make a mockery of the cross. These people are not religious. It's sad. They're not even spiritual. I think sometimes people just be, just want to act like they 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 believe in God, so they don't go to hell. I see if they can trick God itself. That should be sad, bro. You can't trick God, man. And that's a message to myself too, man. Just can't trick God. The next one is the bus to SBS. If if your God, if you think I knew I was waiting for that bitch to finish talking. If, you're, if you think you can outsmart your God, then you are the God over that God then. You feel me? What's the point of you going to God for answers if you think you can trick him? You feel me? So why do all that fake cross and be conniving in the things that you do and think that God don't see these things? And yeah, you wanna wear the cross, you wanna act like you're religious and everything else like that. And I'm like, your perspective of God is different from how you carry yourself. Because in one breath, your perspective of God is the Almighty, the mighty of all and everything else like that. But the way you carry yourself, it contradicts what you say about your God. Because you're not even operating in respect and fear for that God itself. Because you think you can do whatever and act whatever you did. And it's like your God will let it slide. There's no consequences. You feel me? So you have a perspective of what your God is, right? But the things that you do contradict what your perspective is. You feel me? Which meaning that there's no intelligence in the God that you believe in. Feel me? Because if there was intelligence in the God that you believe in, he would have brightened you up a little more and made you act better. And that's beautiful in itself. And it's going to get right into the subject of what is beautiful. My bus was supposed to come. But you know, the, if they would have given me the right time, I would have went to the store, came back, and still caught the bus. But it's like... This is the shit I be talking about. Like, mm -hmm. I wanted to go to the store, but I couldn't go to the store. You feel me? Because it says one time on the map, then it's like, a, then it, it, it's, it's crazy. That's, this is the reason why I do what I do. Anyway, look, man. The next southbound bus to SBS. Hospitality and Carnation, yes, the will arrive in 11 minutes. If my father, right, which, which is God himself, the almighty, the creator of all things, uh, the one who created the world and everything else, if my father, right, if I can't go to my father for answers and protection and guidance and leading me to the right path and everything else like that, and I feel like I can take my own path and I don't need him, then what is the point of him being over me? You feel me? You want him to be there for you and guide you and show you the right way to do things and everything else like that. You want that. You want your God to be more intelligent, intelligent than you. It's like your parents itself. 
It's like your parents itself. Do you think you're smarter than your parents? Of course not. Maybe you probably went to school and all you No, you're still not because they have something called experience in life. They know a thin or two. That's what they say. A thin or two. You feel me? But they know more than you. You feel me? So that's the same thing. You got to treat the God himself. So the reason why I'm even bringing this up is I've seen a few that drive by and do this and they, they throw the cross up on their shit. It's a mockery. They mockery me like... Like I'm supposed to be in fear or something like that. I'm like, yo, miss and ma'am and guy. I'm not in. Why should I walk in fear? You feel me? I just need to be watching. You feel me? Why should I walk in fear? Just because you fearful doesn't mean I gotta be fearful too. You feel me? So they do the cross then make to make it seem like I should pray. I'm like, I'm not gonna pray. Why should I pray? Why should I go to God and pray for something that I know that He knows is going on already? Come on, man. <clears throat> I know that He knows it's going on already. So why would I go to Him to go tell Him, God, this is what is going on? He knows what's going on already. I'm not gonna waste His time with petty, pettiness. He knows what is what. Alright, I'll highlight y'all later, man. You already know.